Which brings me to my big issue tonight. The ecstasy or the agony? Radar Online claims Joe Finley told them that they drank alcohol and did the drug ecstasy the night she vanished. If true, they're living it up at this fancy hotel. You see there, it's quite fancy. He's about to have this big, major audition with America's Got Talent and maybe become famous. They're both high as a kite. Different people react different ways to drugs and alcohol. So addiction specialist Howard Samuels, we talk so much about addict nation on the show. What are the range of reactions when somebody is high on ecstasy and drinking alcohol? Well, Jane, I, I must say it's a very dangerous combination. I had one of my patients OD uh, last year on ecstasy and alcohol. So, you know, for someone to be taking ecstasy and drinking who knows how much in this case can be very dangerous. So it <clears throat> doesn't su surprise me at all that this woman is dead. And what's so unfortunate is the attitude about it. The attitude well, wait that a second. Let me ask you this. 40s. Would you, if you were high on ecstasy, I know people say you get very loving. I've had people, I've never t tried ecstasy, thank God, but I've, people rate. told me you get, you get uh, really loving, you want to hug and kiss. Do you get angry too? Uh, the alcohol makes you uh, unbalanced when you combine the two. So it can have a very dangerous effect because everyone's chemical makeup is different within the body. Yeah, and, I hear you. you know, Joe ex and Laura Finley were married for 26 years. They have three children. And according to Radar Online, the kids are standing by their dad saying he's not responsible. 